third phase of moon. Third phase moon, Blake Cousins, a rancher, and a strange noise and a UFO encounter captured. Oh my god, we got the submitter right here on third phase moon. We're gonna get to him right now. So hopefully, this is him. Jack, you there? Hello. Hello, is this Blake Cousins? Yeah, it's Blake. Um, thanks. You hold on a sec, you're coming in a little broken. We're getting a little bit of feedback. Okay. Oh, I, I've got this incredible footage I really wanted to share with you folks tonight. I know. We already got it. We're uh, going over it right now. And I just wanted to make, uh, I wanted to let you know we enhanced the footage. We already zoomed in on it. We want to share it on Third Phase Moon. Is that okay? That's great. That's exactly what I was hoping for. I, I think everybody really needs to see what I saw out there tonight. This is incredible. I mean... We have been living on this ranch for about four years now. It's a, quite a large ranch, and we have uh, quite a few head of stock out there. And in, in, in recent weeks, we've been getting a lot of problems with the stock. They've been uh, acting real erratic, and we've been having a lot of control issues. Uh, they've been running all around, just getting lost, getting out of the herd, and going crazy up there. And, I was wondering what the heck's going on up there, and I finally went up there, and I was hold on a sec. horses. Hold on. Hold on a sec, Jack. Uh, I just wanted to get to the point that we're uh, looking at this video right now. Of let's, We're going to play the raw, and you're going to hear the soundtrack of what you captured. It's quite incredible. It's a weird sound. I've never heard anything quite like it, but I want to get to this video footage. Stay tuned for the audio and the raw cut coming up. Um, Jack, what about this metallic disc that you captured, as you just said, you found it. Yes, sir, I've never seen anything like it. That's why I, I was so glad I had my camera up there with me because uh, I, I saw the whole thing and I got it on film and it's just incredible. I must say, I don't know uh, what I saw, I saw. And I wanna ask you what you think this thing is. Well, let me tell you, it's nothing that I've ever seen before. Here's a question to I've, I've watched the whole video before uh, you just called in. And, uh, and thanks for calling into Third Phase Moon. That's what it's all about. Real time corresponding around the world. Can you tell us exactly where this was captured? I don't exactly want to say where I live because uh, where I live is right next to a military installation. And that's what makes me a little bit. Uh, uh, troubled about disclosing the location. I don't want to get myself in any trouble. You know, we just moved here just a few years ago and I'm quite happy here. But I, I don't know what's going on up there. Well, you captured something quite amazing. You actually focused. You're not saying much in the video. Were you uh, intimidated by this close encounter? You know, to be quite honest, I was, I was scared out of my pants. You know, I was I didn't think I was going to die, but I I thought I might be abducted or something. It seemed like a spaceship or something I never saw before. And uh, it startled me, quite honestly. Okay, Jack, so you actually, you believe in extraterrestrials? Well, quite frankly, I, I hadn't had up to this point, but after today, I really don't know. I, this is about the only explanation I can come up with. It's either that or some kind of military thing or some combination of the two. Let me, but, let, uh, let me ask you this, Jack. We're going to enhance the video. We're close. We're zooming in on this uh, object, whatever it is. And it seems to like pivot left and right very rapidly, like within a second. Did you notice this? Is this some kind of drone in your opinion? You know... Uh, I've seen a lot of these little drones that the kids are playing with and things like that on TV, but uh, I've never seen nothing fly in that kind of a manner. So, uh, and the size of the two looks a little larger than the drones that I've seen on TV. It was a real windy day out there, too, and 
the thing would just, it just stayed real steady in the sky, and I ain't never seen nothing hanging in the sky like that on a windy day. Even a large plane would have would have moved around or something. Like, I can't understand how it could stay so steady. Well, some people automatically would say it'd be a balloon of some sort, but I'm already agreeing with you, Jack, that I'm watching the winds. Drones really can't be that stable in this kind of wind uh, speed. How? I think it was going about 30, 40 miles an hour, maybe. And then it came to a dead stop. And that, that, that really, uh, that really freaked me out. All right this sound now we're about to get to your raw video jack and we really want to thank you for joining us what about this sound what does it resonate through the body where is it coming from do you think it came from this craft well i felt the vibration myself and i i think i heard it it, it sounded like the sound was coming from inside my own head and that that that's something that also scared me. I never felt like that, like I was in a vacuum chamber in a tunnel or something, the way the sound was coming from, from inside of my ears, uh, in the middle of my head. I don't know. It was, uh, it was definitely a, a vibration. I guess you could say it was a sound. Well, we're going to play the sound right now, Jack. One last question. How old are you? I'm 57 years old. Jack, appreciate it. The sound is quite incredible. Everybody's going to hear that right now. Jack, stay um, in touch, will you? you know, is it still happening, the sound? Has anything been resolved? Well, you know, the ship is not just staying there. It was only there for about a couple of minutes, and then it was gone. And so I'll be, I'll be keeping an eye out, that's for sure. And I will never leave the house without my camera again, because uh, I don't. I still can't uh, exactly come to terms with what I saw today, but I, I'll stay in touch and, and I hope to, to to find some resolution to this, because this is a little bit disturbing for me, and uh, I'd like to have some answers on this. Wow, Jack, appreciate making contact. Well, what you captured is, um, in my opinion, a phenomenon in reverse engineered alien technology. That was Jack from an undisclosed area with incredible video. I'd have to say is quite genuine. We hope uh, Jack has his cameras to the sky and we might even hear from Jack again. Wow, we're um, getting more calls in as third phase of moon is going uh, to break this right now. Here is the raw audio and raw video. Blake Cousins, keep your eyes on the skies, everybody. We'll see everybody again next time.